Welcome to the 5th through 8th grade library. I'm Mrs. Hansen, and I'm your librarian. I invite you to take advantage of all that your library has to offer, both at school and online, through our website and our blogs. When you enter the library, take a look at the new bulletin board about Picturing America Art. You'll see these works of art hanging all around the library and in some of your classes this year. We want you to take time to study these works and post comments and answer questions about them on the Picturing America blog we've made just for you. You'll also see the classroom area of the library. This is where your teachers may bring you to use the smart board or to do research. This is a good place to use the wireless laptops too. The internet search stations can be used for research and for working on projects and reports. The study tables are located next to the reference section so you can use these books while in the library. You can also relax and read or socialize in the lounge area of the library. Here are a few tips on how to get the most out of your visit to the library. If you come on your own, not with a class, be sure to sign in and out. Go to the check-in station to scan your books in and check the screen for the book title to make sure it got scanned in. Then place your books neatly on the check-in cards. When you're looking for books, use the library's signs to direct you to the right sections. Use the spine labels and AR labels on the books to help you locate the books you need. Look at the books on display, like these classics on the spinning rack. Browse the fiction section for a great novel. Or check for a favorite series like Harry Potter or Lemony Snicket. Our paperback section is overflowing. Or you might want to grab a biography of famous people like George Lopez or Barack Obama. Biographies always have a spine label that start with the number 92. Our young adult section has books especially for 8th graders. And there's always new Sunshine State Reader books on the shelf. Earn prizes and get ready for the book battle when you read these books. If you can't find a book by browsing, use the OPAC or online catalog to find the book you need. Once you've got the perfect books, go to the number pad at the checkout station and have a library staff member check out your books. Don't forget that you can access a lot of resources even when school is closed. Use the library's website to get to the reference page and with links to our databases for your research projects. Databases like InfoTrack, Kids InfoBits, and of course the EBSCO Research Center. This year we also have links on the website to audiobooks that you can download at home and load onto your mp3 player or computer. And the best way to keep track of all the happenings in your library is to subscribe by email to our blog. This year we've even added an Ask Your Librarian chat window so you can get help at home a couple of nights a week. And if you're really into social media, you can always follow us on Twitter. Just remember, your library is here for you 24-7 books, research help, resources of all kinds at your service. Enjoy and have a great year.